So, send a report to the head on something that you can't chuck in the bin. Bullying. This is to do with Miss Qureshi, isn't it? If you like. But think about it. If we tackle bullying, we all win. Before you know it, the head's lording the council to the governors. Another example of how inclusive we are. And then we can bring forward stuff we're really into. Like banning cars from school property. Think about it. But I need an answer today. Okay, so what's anybody learnt? Well, I hope we haven't wasted Colin and Dick Rand's time. I mean, I'd hate to think that there wasn't going to be interest in other trips. Is that not to be scared in starting up our own business? Yeah, and like, not to be put off by other people and that. Exactly. If it's what you want. Go for it. The only things in your way are things you put there yourself. OK, um, I'm sure we'd like to thank Colin and Dickron, so... <laughs> right, let's get you lot on the bus. What are you doing now? Well, what do you think? I won't let no-one else say they found out about Mr Wilding first, was I? That's where you're wrong. I already knew. I just didn't think it mattered. No snogging in the back! Hey! Sorry, miss. Hey, Colt, I'm uh, going to see a band tonight. Don't know if you fancy. Uh, um, sorry, I can't. Well, uh, if you fancy another night. You OK? Yeah. Listen, sorry it all had to happen like this. So am I. I've been thinking. I don't think it's best to do anything tonight. I'm driving Mum back tomorrow. I will tell her then, OK? And if you get down there and the moment's still not right? I need you to decide. I need you to swear you'll tell her tomorrow. I'll try, OK? In which case, I'll clear the rest of my things out. I'll be gone by the time you get back. Oh, come on. It's not what either of us wants. But nor's this. Get in these bar. They don't do normal lessons. <laughs> so Mr. Fudgeon said. Why can't we do photocopy cheats? That's what suppliers usually do. Not this one. Health and safety. I'm worried you lick all the ink off and go off on a trip. <laughs> no, I thought we'd have a go at a bit of Shakespeare. Blokes in tights? Yeah. <laughs> blokes in tights, blokes in makeup, blokes pretending to be girls. <laughs> oh yeah, all of human life is here. Hatred. Jealousy. Quite a lot of sex that happens. But you know what? Shakespeare can be boring. But it's not going to be with me. I'm going to make it relevant. You're going to understand it. There we go. If you open it, page 30. Look, I'm not saying we trust him. Just give it a go. I'll catch you off. He's gay. Any idea what stirred this mob up now? One shift. One minute, OK? The next flaming iPhone. I noticed that as well. So how come Clarkson didn't tell you about Wendy Wilding? Look, whatever it is you run about, I'm not interested. Unless he's one and all. One what? Queer. I mean, your mum. She was always a bit dykey. Maybe they were just covering up for each other. Look, whatever it is you're flaming on about, leave my mum out of it. Oh, what? What? So you hide behind your mates, do you? But that's what you're there for. Uh, shut it, you. Like with Miss Koreshi. You lied to cover her back. Well, you don't kid yourself. She dropped me straight in it to save herself. You are really asking for it. Well, now's your chance. This has nothing to do with you two. Why not just leave it between me and her? And have you gone well then off to Clarkson? No way. Come on, girls. She ain't worth it. Right. Tell your mates any incidents of bullying this term that are reported to the year rep in time for the school council meeting. 
you get my text? <laughs> Can you believe it? The lion's den. It's not likely to get any worse. Colin ended it. And you just let him? Well, why don't you ring him? Or better still, go back and see him. And say what? That he was right? I'm a coward. So this is what a coward does, is it? <laughs> Comes into teaching knowing that one day you're going to face this. Come on. Who oh, dear me didn't know, dear? It's not going to get detention, are you, Michaela? Take no notice, sir. If anyone gives you an hard time, let me know and I'll get people to do some serious damage. Violence isn't the way, is it, Janice? Missed out on a proper little minder there, didn't you? No. This is something I should have about. I've done that. I've done that. I've done that. Don't be a woman on your life like wildin'. Well, we have to. Nothing. Stay here. I'm not going in there with him. I told you we should have <laughs> gone. Oh, sure. We did it. What? You're looking at an exclusion. What's that? Empty pockets. Me? Do it now. I didn't even do it. Why me? Got now. Here. Hide this. All right, Langley. Dom. No. Do it! So you can't Shut it! Cooler, now. Sir, we'll see what the head has to say, shall we? Sir. Sure. What are we going to do now? So unfair. What was that? Because it wasn't you? Dom, you were left carrying the can. Literally. Please, sir, I didn't Right. Even... I'll give you a choice before Miss Mason gets here. You tell me you did it, you can go. They kill me. You don't always like. Fine, your choice. Oh, please, no, just. Them things that got writ. I don't think them. I know there's nothing wrong with you. Yeah, but you were still a part of it. I had to be. If I'd have gone, then. They would have wondered why. What's that supposed to mean? Because. They might think things like. Like what? Like that I was gay as well, sir. I know a lot of kids will be intimidated, but I've got Mr. Lawson's assurance that anything we give him will be treated in confidence. Right, I'll start. Today, Michaela White tried intimidating me. And I was scared. And the easiest thing would have been not to speak up. Amber? How long have you known? I'm not sure. Does anyone else know? <laughs> I'm not sure how best I can help. Well, I just wanted to say that with you being I thought you'd understand. Hmm. I'm hardly the best person to give advice. Well, what did you do when you first... Nothing. You won't tell no one? No, of course not. I don't intend to punish you either, all right? Go on, get out of it. Been an eventful day. You in the mood for a talk? Any choice? 